Hello and welcome to the print video. I am Sumi Sukanya Datta and today I will discuss India getting a new antibiotic combination to treat complicated bacterial infections. A molecule developed fully in India that has gone on to become the first ever internationally approved new drug from the country as part of an antibiotic fixed dose combination is now set for local launch. The molecule is N-metazobactam which was first invented by scientists associated with Chennai based Orchid Pharma in 2008. The combination of N-metazobactam and Cefepim was approved in the US and European Union earlier this year. Cefepim is a strong antibiotic that is used to treat moderate to severe bacterial infections. In the US, the combination is being marketed under the brand name of Axblefep. The launch of this antibiotic combination has been indicated for serious infections such as complicated urinary tract infection including acute pyelonephritis when UTI leads to kidney infection and hospital acquired pneumonia. It has also been indicated for bacteremia or bacterial infection of the blood. The launch of the antibiotic drug combination is likely to improve the treatment landscape for serious infections in India, providing patients with access to advanced and effective therapy options. The development is particularly significant for the country grappling with the growing burden of antimicrobial resistance or AMR or cases where disease causing pathogens are getting resistant to existing therapies. Talking to us, Manish Dhanuka, Managing Director, Orchid Pharma explained that though Cefepim is a powerful antibiotic, several superbugs are now getting increasingly resistant to it, limiting the choice of drugs that effectively combat them. In simplified terms, he said the addition of N-metazobactam enhances Cefepim's efficacy by inhibiting beta-lactamases, enzymes that could degrade Cefepim. AMR has been declared as a silent pandemic by the United Nations and the World Health Organization. According to estimates, it contributed to nearly 5 million deaths in 2019. In India in 2019, it was estimated that there were nearly 3 lakh deaths attributable to AMR and 10 lakh deaths associated with it. It was also found that in the country, the deaths due to AMR were higher than deaths from cancers, respiratory inf infections, tuberculosis, enteric infections, diabetes, kidney diseases and maternal and neonatal disorders. In this context, the combination drug provides a powerful treatment option against a range of severe infections caused by resistant bacteria, addressing a critical need in combating antimicrobial resistance. That's all we have in this episode. Thank you for watching.